are there any modifications for using this with children? So the big thing that we created is not so much for children because we won't take it down to the wee little ones, but, you know, at 10, 11, 12, 13, the majority, vast majority do fine with the protocol as written. The area we actually ended up making the most modifications was for those who are cognitively disabled, whether it be from organic brain damage, early onset dementia, late onset dementia, um, you know, some type of traumatic brain injury. We created simplified worksheets. So we're still doing all of the main work, but with a simplified format. And again, all of those are available and we go over them and show them in the training. Um, but they're all available when you um, go through the training and have all those materials. We do share with you how to use those simplified sheets, because I think it is important to address those who just maybe were even born not having the same IQ level as somebody else. And it's just a little bit more difficult than to grasp 10 questions instead of five.